All right, speaking of this job, we now have Picana versus Fumu in our unranked fracket on this Tuesday night. Uh, Picano going for Darkrai, I don't know why. I mean, I think he's been having fun with Darkrai today, I would assume. Who would pick a character that they don't have fun with in this fracket? Alright, so Fumu, knowing very well, I, I imagine anyway, because he seems to do a good job, that you can just murder Puddle with those fire moves. Uh, Picano making pretty nice use of neutral Y. Or NY, whatever you call it. Unfortunately, a YOLO uh, chicken spin got caught by Picano's counter. Picano being one of the dark rays I complain about the most because he seems to do just fine without nightmare mode. Fumu, I don't, I'm not sure. I think he's waiting for an opening. Kind of found one with uh, the dark void to use the Mulga. And now he's got his chance. Now he's going to bring this back. Patience is a virtue, or whatever they say. Thank you, Fuma. But uh, somehow he wound up back to where he was before, which is uh, kind of difficult. Picano coming out of the corner, I'm not sure why. I think Picano actually has the life lead right now. He really doesn't need to come out, but... Misinput from Fumu mentions that a lot. Now Fumu must know the sweet dive kick range, because he's making great use of it when he can. Yo, this bitch chicken kicking in right now! Armors through then doesn't even have to go through burst. Fumu will take the first round. Oh, Fumu respecting Puddle uh, decides to spin chicken it. I'm not sure that was the best option, but it worked. It worked just fine. And it works to get us into duel. Plain first Darkrai versus Mega Blaziken. But kind of not bothering to charge Dark Void. I don't know if he knows it's because it's going to whiff like crazy or just because he doesn't want to. Minus, minus, minus burst. What will Fumu do? Blaze kick doesn't quite reach, maybe because he charged it. I don't know. I mean, I know Darkrai's burst is super minus, but I don't know how much, nor do I know Blaziken's moves. Fuma trying to jump Mulga, which I think he can, just not at point blank. Picano deciding to charge Dark Void, which uh, was kind of a poor choice because he already had the combo going. But he does catch Blaziken in the portal traps. He's having fun with these traps. I used to do these when I could stand to play Darkrai. Counter will get him out of the dive kick range. Darkwood not gonna catch due to flippy frames, whatever you call those. Uh, once again, reminding everyone that barely anyone in Nebraska can duck Blaze Cake on reaction, especially not Picano and I, but he still takes the first, er, sorry, second round. Kind of setting up traps and boom, burning all of them down as if they were a forest that Smokey the Bear wasn't watching over. The kind of Yola grabbing because that's what he does. He's a dark guy that pushes brakes and buttons. And somehow it works. I swear when he does go into Nightmare, he knows a combo, but it doesn't matter that much because he's doing pretty good. Having lots of fun with all these dark ride traps. Puddle gets burned away. Alright, uh, interesting J.A. I think is what that was. Fennekin going to at least waste Fumu's burst a little bit. Fumu going ahead and pop the burst attack. Get that speed boost. Knock Dark right back in the corner. Pierce through his counter. I think he's got this round, but okay. Yeah, face your point's going to save Picano at 1 HP. What will Fumu do to mix this up? Get hit by hands, apparently. Picano going to... He's not going to die with burst. He's... he's better. He knows you don't die with burst. Ah, oh, okay. Weird situation. Fumu must have been... must have hesitated to grab or something. He had the right idea, but it wasn't fast. Oh my lord, that was a kill. Super close match from these two. Kind of gonna take the first game. Alright, uh, I didn't see any changes. 
Yeah, Fuma might have changed support. He usually does that when it's not working. I actually forgot what his other support was. Amulga? Yeah. I'm not sure I agree with Eevee, but it depends on what he thought the difficulty of the last one was, because I'm not sure. Like, when I fight Picano, I'm just confused. Especially his Darkrai. I don't understand it. Eevee, of course, is great for giving you your health back. So, in that case, it's really, really good for Blaziken. Okay, now he's got Eevee. Not a whole lot of opportunity to use it. Now he's got a little bit of opportunity to use it. There we go. Use that Eevee. Get that attack boost. Get that health back. Bump right in there. Pierce through that counter. Kick him into the wall and then miss the... It's okay. Darkrai's weight is weird. Uh, doesn't get hit by Fennec, unfortunately, for Fumu. Ooh, that could have finished if it weren't for facial points. Fumu keeping his distance and shooting over Darkrai's traps. Now, both of them sitting on full burst. I don't know who's gonna pop first. It's really hard to tell what they're thinking exactly. I think Fubo feels like he's in control at this point. But he's, he doesn't get super cocky. He just, he knows what he can do in this matchup, but that's super valuable. More Eevee. Psych him kind of in blocking. Kind of no choice at this point but to use burst. Gets himself cornered and 8x is um, into Blaziken and I am almost positive that bow was just an accident because it's really sex and he had 8x charged. But anyway, uh, Fumu will take that game and what will Picano do? I wasn't looking and I'm not even supposed to say what he's using until it starts. He probably changed characters. Puma <laughs> taking a chill pill, get ready for the next game. And we have the breaks in. We think this is Picano's main. I don't know. I think I think this this character suits him very well. Uh, the Picano is sticking with his old reliable support, which is great. Uh, who switched to Rotom? Am I reading that correctly? Why Rotom? I don't know. I mean, Picano loves Adex, and I I think Blaziken has it. Oh, okay, I keep forgetting to note that he can do the watch attack to talk combo through the fireballs, which is always super cool to watch. Picano already getting a Molga thanks to Breaks and Sunny Day. Fumu using the mysterious ancient technique of walking sideways. Fortunately, gets grabbed, trying a little bit defensive after Blaze Kick. He has Rotom. I just still don't know what he's trying to do with it. Hopefully we will see before the round is up. There we go. Catch Picano jumping. Good. He's a serious jumper. Burning through his HP just to get this... Uh, how much of that combo was skill? Because that still did a lot of damage. He's putting on tons of pressure. Unfortunately for Fumu, he decides to lay off. And Picano yellow grabs in the corner. Because that's his specialty. Yellow grabs and spamming counter. I downplay him a little bit, he's better than that. But that's what it feels like sometimes. Alright, Fumu figuring out that Picano likes to grab decides to just hit something that doesn't get hit by grab. Unfortunately, he went for homing and then boomerang and now we're in duel. But Fumu looks like he's trying to bring this back. Well, of course he's trying to bring this back. He looks like he was bringing it back for a little bit. Playing it patiently. Stylish combo getting through Fire Blast. Or sorry, counter. I don't know why I get those words mixed up. This is going to hit the wa ta ta ta, -ta fireball. But grabs Picano playing defensive. 
He's gonna have to be resourceful with his meter if he wants to survive both these rounds, because... I mean, I know Fumu uses a meter cheer, at least I'm almost positive he does, because it goes up a lot. But oh, Grab will get hit by Fennekin into a breaks in combo that does some damage, pretty significant, and will put Fumu in rage. Maybe that was all part of the plan. Maybe that was just to get the attack boost. It's all part of the plan. The Picano doesn't usually jump in field, so Rotom's not going to do a whole lot. Picano makes up special T. Fumu has 1 HP, but this is where Blaziken shines, right? Yep, 1 HP, rage, secret attack boost. It's not so secret. Yeah, this is the final round of the final- I think this is the final game. I didn't have the bracket on me right now. Oh wait, winner's final, so maybe it's not the final game. Oh my lord, they have a lot to go through. Fumu's got burst. Good boy saving it from last round. Or did he? You know what? I don't know. He has burst now. That's what matters. He didn't save it from last round now that I think about it. He will get the speed boost! Playing it super safe versus Brakeson. Alright, tries to get him. Picano decides to counter, thinking that Fumu's not going to do something. Pierce is counter this time, which he did not. Spin Chicken, gonna carry us back into duel. Okay. Kano is just getting these crazy corner grabs, and it's... It's it's interesting, very. It's working, so it's not a reason you should stop doing it at this point. And Mulga actually working in field. Kind of laying on tons of pressure right now, even though he's like 20 feet away. 16 seconds left. He really doesn't need to charge, but he's doing it anyway. And decides to 8x. Moment of craziness. But, uh... So we're at 2-1. And it's labeled as winner's finals, so I think there's still more... What's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? Alright, seeing the switch. I'm gonna update the score BRB.